economy in Nigeria has, has responded optimistically to the outcome of this past weekend's presidential elections. Both the equity and bond markets rallied after opposition candidate was officially declared the winner. Deji Badmus has this. There had been fears the Nigerian economy might be badly hit if the elections did not go well. But those concerns have now been put to rest after the opposition defeated the ruling party in an election without any major disturbances. For a second consecutive day, the Nigerian stock exchange made significant gains with the all share index surging more than 8%. That's quite a story. Uh, I believe the last time the market had this level of rally was uh, following uh, 1999 elections as well. And that was probably around 4.14%. So today is uh, quite a story. But we think the history is not just from a, a Nigerian perspective. I think it marks uh, our market and our democracy as a lot more mature than the previous times. Pre-election jitters had cast a shadow over the economy, with foreign investors holding back on investments. Okay. We don't believe the foreign investors uh, ever left. We think they just became more cautious, as a way, really. But certainly, you know, we, we, we welcome our long-term investors in our market, uh, and we welcome creative investors who are willing to add value, not just straight the market, but willing to add value and bring expertise. In addition to the stock market, the battered Naira rallied against the dollar. The Nigerian economy, no doubt, is responding favorably to the peaceful transition of power, at least for now. But analysts say the coming weeks will determine how long the so-called democracy dividend will last. Deji Badmo, CCTV, Lagos, Nigeria.